as Walkite prepare to take on Diridawa in game number 157 of week 20 of the Ethiopian Premier League. Temeskian uh, Dana is in charge of Walkite. Uh, this man, Samson Ayele, is in charge of the Diridawa side. There also has Mamadou Sidibe sitting on the bench with four goals. One side of the midfield me being used more than the other. Oh, Gadisa Mebrati has pumped this forward. The header is in the net. Well, this should be Edo Kayele. And that should be the second goal he's scoring in two games. Defenders not quite knowing where Henok Ayele is positioned. Good delivery. You can see him very sure of what he was going to do. A good cross, well weighted. Poor defending from Wahoud Adam, Wahoud Adams and company. Well, let's celebrate the goal first. Lovely header coming in, and you can see it was in the pathway of Enokayele. You know, progressively, it doesn't stop to take any classic or any stylish kind of header. He just pumps it into the net. So he's going back into the box. Here is a shot. Uh, takes a crossbar. Well, Enyeo Kasahun decides to explore what happens up at the front on his own. Uh, quite unexpected. Gets a return ball from uh, Gadisa Mebrate. Odonkara totally beaten on that again. Ball seems to be carving away from the goalkeeper, isn't it, Peter? He definitely knew he had the technique to do that. And uh, thrown into the box, looking for a single touch here. Getani Kebed is arriving slightly later, but surely this man should have put the ball in the net, Peter. Those are some of the chances that you come to rule later. You can see how well weighted it was. Bounced once, would have touched it into the net. There was nothing between him and the goalkeeper. Misses it for one. And I think Getani Kebed just came in late, believing that Behailu Teshegir had touched it in. A little back heel that makes them through here. Two men going for it. It just veers off target. It would have been the nicest, sweetest goal for Behailu Teshegir. Because it came so quickly, so suddenly. And he didn't know the options because there were two men who were going for it. That back heel by Getari Kebede releases the two of them. And the defenders suddenly get caught in sixes. That's a wonderful gameplay there. Behailu Teshegir choosing his spot away from the goalkeeper. Misses it by a whisker I think from the flanks they might get something well that's a long one coming from Yara today uh, and yes he's gonna be staying where Negash was previously and Negash will take the right flank but occasionally just a decoy run from a vantage position tries to score a goal he's got only one goal to his credit this season Yara today from a little bit of a distance. Ooh, it evades the hands of Fidel Getawood and then he manages to push it out. It's going to be a goal kick. There are two or three Walkite players who have the last touch on it by the time it comes out of the hands of Fidel Getahun. A very good shot from Getani Kebede. Oh, Negash mixed himself up there trying to cut it back into a 45. Well, talk about uh, the goalkeeper covering himself and also becoming the defender as well, following up on his own mistake and just covering the distance again. Remedan on his left foot has been pulled down and the referee has pointed to the spot. Well, Remedan is still forward in the box and was just trying to make a, a turn back to pull the ball on his favorite left foot. Skadisa may brought it. Yeah, wrestling him down while uh, he had the ball. But he was already turning into the other side. He I totally got in the better of Gadisa there. Gadisa was well beaten. He used his hands. He puts it in the net, and he does join Fetsu Malemu and Abu Bakr Nasser with seven goals to his credit, and puts Walkite back in this game. Well calculated, away from Ferrell Getahun. Into the net, in a very low one. A well taken penalty, Peter, wasn't it? Looks like he decided where to put it long before he took it. That's what they were looking for, that mistake there. It's going to be offside. There's no two ways about it. They made it so obvious that they wanted to go into the offside position every time. They, they, they were trying so hard to come out, hoping the defenders would come out, and they're not coming out. By the time the ball is being taken, they were already moving into the offside position. Well, Uba Dams and uh, together with uh, Abdul Karim Warku from the Adama, Sunset Technology University Stadium, Swakite 1, Tiradawa 1, it's full time.